Here's Kip Simons trying to move up from fifth place. Kip, the 1996 national champion on still rings. Kip has a nice combination of strength and swing in his routine. Good balanced performer. Back up rise, right to handstand, straight arms, nice and solid. Now back up rise to an inverted cross, a little bit high on the angle, could be a little bit lower. Right to another inverted cross, very difficult combination. That was a kip to an L, not named after him. Getting ready for his dismount. Giant dislocate into a double layout to a perfect landing. A lot of good routines on rings today. Kip Simons, a two-time All-America from Ohio State, moving over to the competition next year. He's going to Ann Arbor to be an assistant at the University of Michigan. Now, this is a swing to an inverter cross. Once again, the angle could be a little bit lower. Up to another inverted cross. Dismount. Double layout. Perfect landing. And the score for Keith Simons. And Simon scores a 9.8 on the still rings. We'll see the conclusion of the men's rings and the women on the floor after this message and a word from your local station. A reminder tomorrow, the conclusion of the World Professional Gymnastics Championship at 1 o'clock Eastern time right here on CBS. In the still rings rotation, Peter, Mihai Baiju scored just a 9.25. Well, he didn't really hold his strength parts, had some trouble with his swing, bent arms and some of the swinging movements. And where strength to weight ratio is everything, rings can be a tough event for a big guy like Mihai Baiju. And Blaz Puljic didn't fare much better with a 9.30. Similar problems as with uh, Mihai. Here's his inverted cross. Doesn't quite come all the way down. Gets deducted for not really holding it. He's also a tall gymnast. Makes rings kind of tough sometimes. Third rotation continues now with Blaine Wilson. He's in second place after two rotations. And this is Blaine's best event. He was in the finals at the Olympic Games in Atlanta. Very, very strong in the rings. Pull to an inverted hang. It's a backup rise right to a planche. Easily makes it. Right to another Maltese cross. A little bit lower than a planche. To another Maltese cross. Give to an L. He makes all of his strength parts look so easy. There's a giant right to a handstand, just solid as a rock. Back up rise. Most likely getting ready for his dismount. Double to Zinova backflip, perfect landing. That's gonna score tremendously well. Probably the best performance so far of the day. Blaine is just so powerful in the shoulders. There's a backup rise right to a plange, and he holds it easily. Goes right then into a Maltese cross. It's like a plange, but you see he's lower. And does a great dismount. It's a double to sink, double back flip, and just zeroes in on the landing. Just glues it into the mat. And here it is, the first 10 of the competition for Blaine Wilson. the first 10 of his career.
John McCready up next on the rings. He'd like to make up some ground in this rotation. As John's gotten stronger over the last couple of years, he's really improved his ring performance. It's a kick to a cross. Back kick to an L. Is required press to a handstand. Another double back within the rings. Right back up to a handstand. Got a swing going here. He's got to stop that swing. Does a fairly good job of it. And a double layout dismount. You know, he really didn't have all the strength that he, he could have had in that ring routine. He really only had his iron cross. And this probably will not score as well. Needs to add more strength skills in that routine. Now here's his iron cross. Let's take a look at that. Now, folks, there's A through E level skills. That's only a B. Imagine what the what the E is. Here's his dismount. It's a double layout. Little step in the landing. The score for John McCready. And McCready scores a 9.50. Nine point five oh. Oh. Our final Last up on the rings, Dimitri Trush. Trush has really stayed in great shape since Atlanta. He's probably one of the best prepared gymnasts here in this competition. Back kick right to an L cross, nicely done. Beautiful cross sequence. Got a nice toe point, real command of his performance here. Beautiful inverted cross, look how low he is. Almost completely horizontal. Right to another inverted cross, exceptional sequence. This is another great performance. Let's see if it's gonna be another 10. Double layout, sticks the landing. Wow. That's gonna score very, very well. Those inverted crosses were really done well. Cruz, the Russian all-around champion last year, drawing on some of that experience. As we go into the final round tomorrow night. One of the hardest parts about the inverted cross sequence is to be able to hold it at the horizontal level. Now, as Trush lowers down, you can see him right there, just about horizontal. The arms are just about horizontal. Done very, very well. Into another one. That combination, there it is, stop right there. Look at that, almost completely horizontal. Very, very well done. Gets ready for his dismount. Double layout, perfect landing. And the score for Dimitri Trush, 9.925. Today's competition is completed for the men. Halfway through, Blaine Wilson with that 10 moves into the lead. Roethlisberger drops to second. Dimitri Trush is in third. Let's go over to Michelle Tafoya now, standing by with our leader, Blaine Wilson. Well, Blaine Wilson wasn't altogether thrilled with his performance on the pommel horse, so he just went out on the rings and nailed a 10, the first 10 ever in your career. Uh, yep, ever since I've been competing, and uh, it feels really good. I was, I was surprised. Uh, Pete said it might be a 10. I said, no way. But uh, it felt good. You and John Roethlisberger have been neck and neck throughout. As you head into the remainder of the competition tomorrow, what do you need to do? I uh, need to go out there and hit some sets. Uh, we're going to be close. Uh, it's going to be a very co close competition. You know, who knows? Somebody might come up and beat us, but um, I'm just going to go out there and have some fun tomorrow. Good luck. Thank you. Coming up, she's the Katerina Vitt of gymnastics. Svetlana Boganskaya, the women, compete on the floor in a moment. <laughs> 